Day 739, being Christopher Cruz, uh, just got through the first session of this conference. Freaking amazing. I am in such the right place at such the right time. Oh, and the conference called is called uh, For Such a Time as This, so that's interesting. Um, but yeah, so two really big things. Uh, the first thing that I realized is that like he was talking about how you know, he never got a big vision for what he's doing. Like, he never got this huge vision that he'd be leading this kingdom movement and, you know, bring in all, you know, tens of millions of dollars. And, like, he never, God never gave him that vision. And he said, you know, sometimes people give, God gives them a vision. And God gave me a vision of, you know, leading this revolution that's changing the world and, you know, millions of people and all that. And the problem with that is I, I don't know how to live into that now. So I feel paralyzed because it's like, I can't make that big thing happen. And so we were talking in groups, like what's the biggest question you wanna have answered? And for me, it was like, how do you start small? Like for me, it's like, God gave me this huge vision. And because I can't go from step zero to step 9,000, which is like where that vision is that, that he gave me, like I don't even take step one. And that is a massive thing that is holding me back. And which is crazy because I coach my clients on that. Um, but it's just like making me see like, you know, I can't do, um, you know, I can't achieve what, what God has given me right now. Like the vision he's given me, I can't achieve that right now. So I need to get down to what's step one. What can I achieve now? What can I do now? What can I crush now? Because I look at the vision that he has called for me and even showing up at this event and seeing this and being like, man, I should be having my own event like this. Like I should be on these stages. I should do this. It's just like seeing that is, um, it's just like, I need to get smaller again. I need to get like, I don't need to get smaller, but I need to start smaller. Be like, hey, he didn't start there. You know, this is where he is, you know, four years later, but he didn't start there. Like Chris, where do you have to start? And the question I asked myself is, where can you crush it now? And it was like helping believers find their purpose. Like I, I crush it with that. I kill it with that. I'm amazing at that. And it is such a needed and necessary thing. And um, so that was huge to just be like, hey, you don't need to focus on putting to building this massive tribe of warriors and all that stuff. All you need to do is focus on helping those believers become warriors by helping them find their purpose. So start helping believers find their purpose and do it in groups like you want to. Do it in small groups of two to 10 people and you know, make it affordable. Like don't outprice everyone, just start there, start small, it's okay. You know, if you have five people that are paying $1,000, you know, for, for five or six weeks of, of group coaching, that's okay. Like, that's okay. Like make it affordable, make it accessible. Like just start there step one step one like what can you do now what can you crush it at now that was a question i asked myself what can i crush it at right now and i can crush it at helping believers become warriors by helping them find their purpose and then i just got really clear is what is a warrior of god a warrior of god is someone who knows their purpose and they're living into it period and so how do you become a warrior of god step one you find your purpose step two you live into it so i just need to focus on step one I need to help believers find their purpose. Living into it is when I'm launching, you know, the the, the weekly group calls and you know all this stuff with Warriors of God and the, the tribe and all that. But I'm like trying to I'm trying to launch that before I even get there. It's just like I'm trying to take step five and I haven't even taken step one. God, how could I not see this? It is ridiculous. This is why I get paralyzed because I see the end result. And because I'm such like a, a big thinker and such a, you know, pie in the sky thinker, like up in the clouds, I don't look down to see the first step. And so I look up there and I'm like, how the fuck am I gonna get up there? I'm not at that level. I can't even do this. I can't even lose weight. I can't even do that. I can't even pay my rent. Like, how the fuck am I gonna lead a, a revolution? But can I go down here? Oh, can you help a believer find their purpose? Yeah, easily, effortlessly. It's like. Do you have an amazing system for it? Yep. Do you have a product for it? Yep. Do you know a bunch of believers? Yep. Do they need to find their purpose? Yep. Are they struggling with not knowing their purpose and feeling like their full potential not living into it? Yep. Okay, do you wanna coach them all one-on-one? -on -one? Nope. So then how do you wanna do it? In group? Yep. Can most of them afford $7,000? Nope. Can most of them afford 1,000? Yep. 
So go find three or four or five believers who want to find their purpose over the next six weeks, charge them 999 bucks or whatever it is, and just start doing it. One call a week and then do it. And after they find their purpose, they're going to need to live into it. So then maybe they join a weekly group call for the, the believers who now know their purpose and want to live into it. And you do a weekly call with them and you do a weekly call with the new believers who are trying to find their purpose. So you have one call a week of helping people find their purpose and you have one call a week of helping those people who've already found their purpose live into their purpose. So one find your purpose call a week and one live into your purpose call a week. One call with a group of believers who are finding their purpose and another call with a group of believers who have already found their purpose and are now living into it. That's simple. I can do that shit. Two Zoom calls a week. Yep. Easy. I can do that. I can do that. Of course I can do that. That's easy. That's nothing. Oh my God. Wow. And I've only been here like two hours and that was the first session and I've got three days of this. Freaking amazing. Ah, thank you, God. 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 God. Da, 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 da. Thank you, God, so much. Wow. That's amazing. Whew. All right, let's go.